The next step is siphoning the wort out of the brew pot into your fermenter. It's really important that you don't suck on your siphon. Your mouse got bacteria and microbes in it that are going to infect your beer. To set up your fermenter underneath your brew pot, make sure the tap on your fermenter is turned off. Get a clean and sanitised rubber tube and fill it with boiling water. Pinch both ends, sit one in your wort, hold one above the fermenter and let the lower end go. Try and aerate your wort as much as you can when you're siphoning it. This will help introduce oxygen into the wort and will mean your yeast is going to be more effective. Another trick is to get a short plastic tube, like something off a bottling wand, and stick this into the end of the rubber tubing. This is going to create more of a drop into your fermenter and mean it's less likely for spills to happen. When you're siphoning, you want to leave as much of that hot protein sludge in the brew pond as you can. It's okay if some ends up in your fermenter, but if too much, it can cause some problems with the beer.